Hello YouTube, this is Paint by BHM again. Um, it's been a long time since um, I made my last video for here YouTube, but well, um, I've been pretty busy with job in my bureau, and well, and now I got some relaxing days, and um, I decided to update my my videos, and um, well, um, I want to introduce you a couple of pipes that I've been purchasing recently through the eBay. Um, um, those both pipes are Danish um, and from two pipe makers that I really wanted to have pipes from. Um, I was uh, I found many of these pipes in the eBay US market, and I was having some problems uh, to find them uh, here in the European eBay. But finally, I found a seller who was having um, some of these pipes and. Uh, well, I decided to pull the trigger and give myself a little Christmas present. And well, let me introduce you. Uh, first one is a um, is a Bjarne pipe. Um, is this bent classic shape pipe? As you can see, the logo here from Bjarne. Um, well, as you know, Bjarne. Uh, um, so. Pipe maker, pipe carver uh, passed away um, a couple of years ago, I think. And uh, I've been looking for uh, some of his pipes. And well, when I found this one in the German eBay market, and well, I, I think it's a really fantastic pipe. It's an estate pipe, but um, I think that um, um, it didn't need so many uh, cleaning, so it was already pretty clean. The grain stays really good. Um, I like this um, red um, grain uh, finish. Uh, it's, a, it's a classic um, shape, but I really like those kind of pipes. Really short and compact and also warmer, which is perfect for me because um, I, I used to, to be in smoke, to smoke pipe when I, as I am working in my bureau, and those are perfect pipes, really light, small, easy to be smoked and um, you can um, really clinch it in your in your mouth and smoke it as same time as you're working with your computer so I really like this kind of pipes. Um, um, I've realized that this pipe is perfect for um, um, for flakes because it has some chimney uh, tall bowl which, is, which make it perfect for, for for flakes and um, well I don't know I really like it uh, it was really cheap so I think I paid like 30 bucks something like that for it I mean for me it's like bargain and I'm really pleased with it um, so I think it was a nice purchase but um, um, at the same time I saw this pipe I saw another one uh, from an, another um, Danish pipe maker and I decided that um, I wanted to have it. I mean, um, as you can see, this is a medium, um, small uh, size ball pipe. So look what it came after. Da, da, da. Yes, this is a Bari Biking. Um, I start getting interested in Bari Biking pipes since I saw uh, by friends CHA smoking them in his videos. Um, I find they're a really massive, large piece of briar, but I think they also have some elegant um, design. Uh, in this case, I like this panel um, shape here. As you can see, it has some little rustication on top of the bowl. It's this panel, eight panel shape here. And then, um, well, a nice grain nice beautiful grain um, stem I have to make still some cleaning on it but it's not that bad um, pretty nice um, it's a large it's the largest pipe in my collection it is like 20 centimeters long and 7.5 centimeters high um, I, I you cannot even imagine how many how much tobacco can you put here inside I mean is they have a package, a package is, is going there inside. Um, it takes like a couple or three hours of good smoke. 
Um, and it smokes really cool. Uh, no bite tongue with this with this pipe. Ball doesn't get too hot. Uh, I guess that the massive uh, ball walls and uh, thick ball walls have something to do with it. But um, I find it really nice. Uh, a little bit difficult to be clinched. So it's like um, a pipe for having them in your hand and then smoking. But uh, I mean, it's huge. I mean, it's huge, huge piece of briar. Um, I really love it. I mean, I mean, I really think it's fantastic pipe, fantastic pipe. So these are my two new pipes in my collection. It's like Big Brother and the smaller one. Um, both, I think that they were good, good acquisition, good price for them, not too, not too expensive. Uh, I'm really pleased with them, and um, I decided to buy uh, another, also a um, Danish tobacco um, for those pipes. Um, I'm really I prefer aromatics instead of English blends, and I bought the. Um, 2011 W.O. Larsen uh, Limited Edition. Um, it's an aromatic, I still didn't try it, so I'll let you know how how is it this one. Uh, 2010 edition was really nice aromatic tobacco, um, so I'll let you know about this one. So, that's all by now. Um, I want to um, wish all of you there in the pipe community a merry, very merry Christmas and and happy new year to all of you. Um, um, it's not long since I am in the pipe community, but it's nice to see all of you guys, to watch your videos, to know that um, you are enjoying from this fantastic hobby. And I hope that in 2011 that goes on. So, uh, once again, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. See you in 2011. Bye bye.